With LTE expanding rapidly and the handset ecosystem getting ready, 2014 will be a booming year for voice and video over LTE deployments. VOLTE is a disruptive mobile communications evolution that covers legacy CS networks, evolution to all IP voice, carrier grade voice revenue consolidation, and communication capability monetizations through openness. Huawei has a unique end-to-end -end approach to simplify this evolution in a stepwise fashion for mobile operators. I'm here with Yuman Mao, Vice President of Core Network Product Line for Huawei. So Yuman, what's new for Huawei in voice and video over LTE at Mobile World Congress this year? This year we bring very comprehensive and compelling demos of VRTE. Uh, first, we will show you uh, the call network transformation. Uh, actually, it covers the whole evolution journey of VRTE, uh, including CS4 back and SRVCC and cloud-based uh, MS, centralized MS. And second is a cloud-based MS. I think it's Cloud now is not only a concept anymore. Uh, in the middle of last year, we passed the POC test in Taiwan operator in Europe. And here you can show our MS called Live Demo. And you can also uh, sh uh, show, uh, see our uh, orchestration manual, which help the automatic service deployment and uh, uh, dynamic service uh, scheduling. And third one is uh, enhanced user experience. And uh, actually, uh, with a combination of VRT and the native RCS, the end user can uh, experience high definition voice call, video call, and multi party voice call, video call, uh, and also its message presence and content sharing. And uh, even you can make a call from, your, uh, from the web browser. Uh, it is based on the WebRTC technology. The first one is network openness. We will help the operator to open their network capability to third party. So let the third party to, to develop a new application based on the capability operator provided uh, uh, so uh, they can bring more value to this new VRT network. Uh, it's over there, you can see the smart doorbell and e-commerce, e-health, and so all kinds of application bring by the third party uh, to the enterprise, to vertical industry, and also to individual customer. Outside this hall of Huawei, we also have joint demo with China Mobile and Telefonica. Uh, with China um, Mobile, we provide, uh, we, we have joint demos of VRT, RCS, and WebRTC and cloud-based MS. And with Telefonica, we help them to show their vision, uh, Unica, they call it Unica vision. It's an NFV-based MS. What differentiates Huawei in the voice and video over LTE field? Oh, I think uh, the first one is Huawei is the only vendor who can provide end-to-end -end solution. You know, we have chipset, we have handset, we have radio access, and also MS call and EPC, uh, EPC uh, system. So it's an end-to-end solution. Uh, of course, we are open to integrate with other vendors, but if the operator choose Huawei end-to-end -end solution, I'm sure uh, we can help the operator to short time to market and improving operation and maintenance efficiency. Uh, this is the first one. Second, Huawei is leading in cloud-based MS. Uh, as I mentioned before, Huawei is uh, 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 first to pass the, uh, the POC test of cloud-based MS. Uh, in the middle of last year with a Taiwan operator in Europe. Uh, Huawei cloud-based MS can run in on Huawei Fusion Sphere as well as from a third-party cloud OS. And the third one is consistent innovation. We are still thinking how to help the operator to monetize their virtual network. And uh, as you know, we can provide uh, RCS, and uh, business use it to help the operator to, uh, uh, to improve their legacy voice revenue. At the same time, 
We also uh, provide communication as a service. We uh, work together with third party and let them to use the capability we open uh, uh, from the core network to bring more valuable uh, service and revenue to the operator. Thank you. Can you tell us about Huawei's progress in the marketplace? Uh, until now, we have already got 15 uh, commercial projects of WRTE, and uh, we are uh, a strategic partner of Taiwan operator, for example, China Mobile, and we are also selected as a, a, a cloud-based MS vendor and a face and mobile convergent MS vendor uh, for, uh, for, the, uh, for two uh, very top operators in Europe. And uh, in addition to the whole VRT solution, some products in this domain also make very uh, good progress. For example, single SDB. Uh, now we have over uh, 3 billion uh, subscribers all over the world. And with zero accident during the uh, past six years, I think it's very remarkable achievement. Second is SPS. Huawei SPS actually last year made big progress because we are the only vendor who can, who can provide IP, STP, DRA and TDM signaling together, converging the products. And uh, last year we got, we got over 40 contracts and uh, that is about uh, 40, uh, 30%, over 30% market share. And now can you tell us about the next steps? Next step, uh, our story is the same. First is uh, core network transformation. We will help our customer go through this journey. At present, we have over 3 billion customers all over the world. We will go together with our customer uh, from this their current uh, CS network to VRTE. Second, we will st continually strengthen our competence in cloud-based MS, and this year I'm sure we'll have a commercial launched uh, cloud-based MS in Europe. And the third one is consistent innovation. That's the uh, communication as a service. We'll still uh, um, help the operator to build the, uh, the, the ecosystem and help the operator to get more innovative service from third party and bring more revenue to our customer. Thank you so much, Yuman. You're welcome. Thank you.